So here's how this is going down. We are gonna travel around the world. I'm talking searching far and wide to the very first six Terra Raids we find. We are gonna catch the Pokemon that live within these crystals and then we're gonna fight. If we click on a raid, we are stuck with that Pokemon. Also, if we fail the raid, we can't try it again and you gotta just move on. Once our teams have been set, we will then have a 15 minute period to make these boys as battle ready as possible. And that's pretty much it. It's time. I'm inside of my muck, pause, and ready to go. All right. I'm here with the boy Cypher. Shout out to the shout out to the guy. Go heck, go check out his channel. What's happening, bro? Let's do this. I'm not getting beat like I did last time. It's not happening. I am so well prepared for this. It's not even funny. Are Wait. we ready? Rev your engines. I think I'm ready. All right, let's get I'm it, ready. bro. Let's get it. So we look out into the world and we see no raids. Where the fuck? Where did all the raids go? Hello? Isn't there usually big beams of light shining into the sky? What's going on here? We see our first raid. I've been summoned like Batman. This this green beam of light. All right, big blue rock. It's, it's young Breaking Bad out here. We found some meth, and our very first raid and the first member of the team will be a Water Tropius. <laughs> of course it is. Sweet Jesus. All right. Well, what would you look good in, huh? You're a friend. You're going in a friend ball. He is friend shaped. This is like the first Tropius I've seen in this game. I forgot this home homeboy existed, but. There we have it. Banana boy. First raid then. What do we got? <laughs> All right. Team check. Powerful. Oh, I just... I killed him. <laughs> I just launched him off a cliff. Hello? Oh my god, he's dead. Raid number two. Please give me something good and not... Uh, something bad. Okay. Oh my... <laughs> Wug Trio? <laughs> this is true. I've got a Tropius and a Wug Trio. My team is about to have the longest necks. I'm just gonna have the theme, I guess. Very long boys. I mean, I do love some Wug Trio, but not if I'm trying to win. <laughs> yeah, this boy kind of thick. Oh, never mind. I was gonna say he kind of thick, but he dead. So some hot dogs, and that, I'm really gonna have, things are gonna really need to turn around here. My team, my team so far does give pretty good neck though, and that may be something to be proud of, maybe not. I, however, I think it's pretty neat. I have a good feeling about this purple one. This one here looks nice. And, uh, it's a Vigoroth. I, <laughs> The four-star Vigoron? Okay, well, I guess slacking is coming. I don't know. I mean, that guy kind of strong. <laughs> I wish he were like a Dragonite or something cool, but... Monkey, added to the team. Guess what you get? A Premier Ball. It matches him! You look good, you battle good, huh, Vigoroth? That's what it's all about. Okay, so team member number three acquired... And the vibes are not that great, but we can make anything work around here. It's my specialty anyway, it's fine, it's fine. How's it going, bro? How many mons you got? Two. <laughs> Feeling good about the two, or what's the what's the general uh, consensus? I, you know what, man, like, listen, like, I don't wanna brag, right? The team I have going right now, it's a fire. Wait, how many do you have so far? I got three. And it might, three? Okay. honestly, it might be the best three Pokemon I've ever even seen in Raid, so you're, you're fucked. Nah, you're, you're bluff. I'm calling your bluff right now. <laughs> I'm calling your bluff. Lies. But yeah, uh, I had a plan. I'm kind of chalking it up, and uh, chat's helping me, so. Damn, chat! Three Mons? What the fuck? We just had to lie our ass off right there. Okay, Dark? Wait, what is this? Dark. Okay, you know what? Fuck it. We're full sending. Ooh, chat, 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 chat. That's a good one. Chat, this is fucking good. All right, another blue one, which uh, it doesn't matter. I'm not doing it for the Terra types. I'm doing it for believing that there's a strong boy on within this. Please, Walter White, give me something good. Lichen Rock. Okay, this is this is better, but is this good? I wouldn't say good but it's definitely something. 
And so, another four star we go. Well, go ahead and melt the old doggy. And you're coming with me, Bucky. Buck, Buckaroo. How do I catch this guy? You can have a premier belt too. The first, like, decent dude we found is a Lycanroc. He's, you know, frail, but he's a good pupper. You know what I'm gonna do though? I'm gonna look on the map and see if I can find a six star raid. Cause if I if I if I can go into a six star raid, I think I'll, I'll have a dog in this fight. All right, Fire Gallade, you are hey pretty decent, and I actually I can beat this pretty easily. I mean, I have my zoom roll. Thing is, I need chat to help me with this one, and if I fail this once, I can't <laughs> I can't use it. <laughs> So, if you guys join my link code, do not troll and throw, <laughs> because I really need this Pokemon. All right, listen, guys, I really need us to win this, because this Gallade might just save the team. At least, like, not counting Terra types, we're actually getting some pretty decent diversity here. <laughs> I don't know. The power of Azumarill is too much for this candle-headed fella. You can have a luxury ball because I'm feeling like you're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna sweep this match for me. So you can sit pretty in this luxury ball. Yo, yo, yo! What's that Voltorb doing? Oh shit! He can hurt himself. Yo! I'm doing this. I'm doing this. What is our final team member going to be? Please give us something good. Don fan. Okay. Hey, that's actually decent. He's not the greatest Tusk. While his Tusk may not be great, they are... They're still average. My girlfriend said so. All right, we're gonna catch you in something something cool. You look like you could belong in a heavy ball. There we go. I'm using this heavy ball because I believe in you, Don Fan. And that is the team. Uh, I can say that it didn't really... I didn't get what I was expecting, but that's the fun of it, you know? Check out these absolute legends. It started off a little bit rocky, got a little bit better. Um, but I'm, ha I'm overall happy with the squad. You know? Except for you, Karidon. You're always in the way. All right, what are you at, bro? I am on number five right now, and I'm about halfway done with it, almost. Okay, cool. I just finished my sixth. We will chill okay. until you get ready. All right, bet. All right, let me know. Chad, did he say love you? Why does it sound like he said love you? Yo, am I crazy? Two hours later. Do I have any shot? I don't know if I have any shot in this one. I don't know if I have any shot in this one. All right, to not keep hating win, uh, we lost this one. There's no shot in hopes and of us getting that. So we're just gonna go two random ones and we're just gonna have to chalk up the team there. All right, what do we got? I mean, actually, I'm, oh, I'm not actually mad at this. All right. What do we got, boys? Yo, Revival Blessing? <laughs> Wait a minute. All right, brother. I finally caught my six mon. Holy shit. We are basically going to, we have a timer, 15 minutes to rare candy, teach things moves, and also give them hold items. We are, uh, we're also going to be using hold items to make things a little bit interesting. We're not going to be EV training because ain't nobody have the money for that. All right. Fuck! <laughs> I have no confidence. <laughs> you have no what? I have no confidence in this, but you know what? We're full sending. Three, two, one. Go for it. All right. Let's go. The timer has been started. And first of all, I'm going to give everybody some rare candies just to see if I get any high level uh, level up moves. Okay, I'm going to I'm going to take off my face camera real quick. Only reason why so I can see my screen. So let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Uh, Icy Wind would be not be bad. Icy Wind would not be bad for for Delibird. I will give it that. Damn! His moveset is clean! Wug Trio. I know you have the worst learn set. You, have, you get no good moves. Honestly, okay, look. I prefer Liquidation over Triple Dive. Triple Dive hits three times with a power of 30. So it's a 90 base. Whereas Liquidation is 85, but it's 100% accurate. And so, ain't nobody got... Why would they give... The Wug Trio, his own new move, and it's just not even as good as Liquidation. Drain Punch! Yo! That's huge. 
It has Rage Fist. Okay, so I just have to go use it 10 times. Okay, or 20 times. Okay, cool. Oh, Vigroth. Now we could choose to leave this guy, but I'm definitely going to evolve it uh, because slacking is going to come through with the absolute power. And he's going to have to loaf around. His elbow is so strong, he's just holding himself up by the elbow. Lycanroc. I don't know if I... I hope I have a TM for Stealth Rock. Stealth Rock. Didn't even need the TM. Let's go. How do you remember moves, though? Am I drunk? Gallade's already level 75, so I'm just going to use 10 just because he wants some candy, too. Can't leave, let him feel left out, you know? And then we have the Don. The fan. I'm your biggest fan, Mr. Don. Oh, remember moves. Okay, here we go. As Revival Blessing, let's go, boys. Hopefully we can learn. Hopefully we can take out 20 Rage Fist Mons. That's gonna be that's gonna be the challenge, bruh. I don't think I can do it in five minutes. Fuck no. Fuck no. Now, let's go into the bag and let's take a look at some hold items for these fellas, huh? King's Rock. I'm, <laughs> I'm giving a King's Rock to Wug Trio, and he's gonna get a flinch that wins us the game. I'm gonna go to a Deli Bird shop real quick. That's not a bad idea. Hold up. Twitch chat is coming in clutch right now. That's actually a fantastic idea. <laughs> Let's do that. Oh, we're gonna flinch. We're gonna flinch the hell out of him with this thing. Triple dive for the boys. Gotta name these things the boys. All right, no more liquidation. Hey, okay, now we have triple chance to flinch. Let's go. Silk scarf. Um, let's do fifty thousand dollars. Damn, I only have fifty k. Well, let's put this life orb on Gallade, probably. Yeah, there we go. Give that to Gallade. Now I just need something for Tropius. Oh, you're going buried out, my dude. Citrus, I had a bunch of these. Give that to you. Boom. Just like that, the team is ready with four minutes to spare. I'm putting Substitute on somebody. I'm putting Substitute on Tropius, bro. Maybe? Maybe not. I could give, I could give Tropius Swords Dance as well. Sub Swords Dance? I'm gonna give it Substitute. Because so, it, it pairs nicely with that Citrus. Oh, but do I want to even get rid of Aerial Ace? My other stab, 60 power. I kind of like the Tail... Yeah, I'm, gonna get rid of, I'm getting rid of Tailwind. We're not going to need the Tailwind. It's fine. All right. We're finished. It's like in those episodes of Chopped where like they like finish their meal too early. And they just like make themselves one. Yo, brother. We might be sitting pretty good. I have defensive walls. I have one special defensive wall. I have one physical wall. I have two, like, three power hitters. I have a fucking deli bird. Dude, I think we're ready. All right, bro. 30 seconds. How are you feeling? Uh, okay, listen. I am 100% more confident than I did last time. <laughs> good to know. Good to know. Like, listen, they're, they're, they're leveled up. They got good move sets. And, like, the items are on there. I, we're ready. Let's go. All right, boy. Let's do it. Are you ready to go? Oh, in? God. 10 seconds left, uh, but we don't even need it. No! Fuck! Chat, you're right. Fuck. <laughs> oh, no. Did he mess up? No, I, I'm a dummy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck, dude. I'm a fucking moron. Okay. All right, chat. Are we ready for this? Fuck. Dude, you guys are so right. Why didn't I keep acrobatics? I should have got rid of Crush Claw, bro. All right. He got, okay, he got the gar, gargan, Garganaki, Garganachi. He got the Garganical, bro. No. That's fine, though. If he doesn't Terra, then Tropius eats it. Okay. Primate, Delibird, Rabska, freaking Braviary, regular Tauros, regular Paldean Tauros, and Garganachi. So, what looks good here? Um, and what looks bad for me? I don't know. He's gonna have the revival blessing, bro. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go ahead and just lead Stealth Rock Lycan Rock. I'm honestly kind of worried about the Primeape. If he put an Eviolite on that thing, I am in that. Primeape is so good because it can be Eviolite now. Also, 
what is he gonna terra i don't know the, the terra types are so random right because like ordinarily in battles you can have like th there's generally meta terras that people use but in this like no, you're not gonna know what the hell is gonna turn into what so let's lead like in rock we can guarantee to get stealth rock up which only really is good against braviary and the bug grabs good thing but and I guess Deli Bird. Never mind. Half of his team. We want Stealth Rock up. But is the Deli Bird really a threat? I'm sure that thing's sashed. I gotta be worried about the Destiny Bond Deli Bird. He's gonna lead off with Amazon Prime. Damn, my guy just straight be nicknaming stuff too. Okay, so. <laughs> this thing is for sure going to be setting up spikes or something? What did they fuck? What is Deli Bird about to do to me? Except to give me presents. I'm gonna Stealth Rock. I'm gonna deliver these hands expediously through Amazon Prime. So I get them rocks up. I also... I can just Accelerock twice, twice, and he can't Destiny Bond. He does go for the spikes. <laughs> His presence turned out to just be spikes to hurt. What a, what a shit Santa you are. Alright, well... I mean, I basically just Accelerock here. It's gonna knock him to Sash, and he can't, uh... He can't do nothing about it, huh? I still have my Sash intact, so I feel like... Yeah, he's sassed. Okay. Should've taught Rapid's been a Dawn fan. So, okay, that's fine. He's just gonna actually Icy Wind. That's actually not a bad strat, because with the speed drop, you know, he had a potential to, you know, Destiny Bond. But, now we just go for this. He just lets this thing die. There's no way you're letting the Deli Bird live. Let's go. Deli Bird down. Delivery. For you this time, buddy. Straight to the fucking cemetery or something. I don't know. Okay, one down. Now he switches into Primate probably, or the Tauros, or the Gar Garganical. Garganical, Garganacle. Nobody knows how to say it. I'm calling him. I'm like po Joey Poke Game. Shout out to the dude. Garganacci. I'm thinking probably Primate. No, it goes Tauros. Okay. All right. All right, Tauros. So this thing's cud chew. Um, and I don't have shit to touch this with. Who wants to switch into a Tauros, though, is the question. Probably Donphan? I'd be so sick if Ice Spinner got rid of hazards. Am I right? I'm going into Donphan because I know that I can take hits from this thing. It's also very strange Wi-Fi battling with nothing having, um, like, optimized IVs or EVs at all. So it's like, it feels like we're playing in freaking Let's Go Pikachu and Eevee here. It's like down to it's like Pokemon down to like basics. But there's something beautiful in the simplicity of it. Alright, we can hurt by some spikes. He just goes for the raging bull, and we eat that. So what item would you think this thing is? Probably choice scarf. Scarf Tauros, which is not ideal for my team. I am going to knock off. I don't know if he stays in here, but it's gonna take him a few more. What's a switch into Donphan? Probably... Yeah, he doesn't have much to switch into Donphan, to be honest. Donphan does actually really well against this team. But I don't have any reliable recovery, obviously, other than leftovers, so... Taking that chip kind of sucks, but... Luckily, this isn't a Water Tauros. If it was a Water Tauros, that'd be a whole lot worse. He's just a regular boy. He ain't got no cool bedazzles on his mane or whatever the hell. I'm just gonna stay in the Raging Bull. He just wants the chip. Okay, that's fine. One more actually kills me. This is not good. Ideally, you would have switched out there, but at least now it is Scarf. So now I don't have to worry about Scarf Tauros. Nothing hits pretty hard, so that's fine. Yeah, if it was Water Tauros, that, uh, yeah, the Thunder Fang would have been nice. But now, I've actually kind of ruined my Dawn Fang. It was kind of my easiest switch into this thing, and now there's nothing really this guy can do, and it's not really worth saving this thing, so I guess I just click Earthquake, and you hate to see it. A couple of Raging Bulls, and it's 5-5, five to five, just like that. Okay. Best answer for Tauros is likely Gallade, and I could even Swords Dance. He probably, I, I go Gallade, he then switches into, hmm, he doesn't have much to sell. I could just straight up go band slacking and just Giga Impact and guarantee something dies. He actually probably goes in there, the salt thing at that point. Do I go? I'm go hold on. I'm bringing in the Wug Trio. Give me. Get, hear me out. 
Wug Trio is the greatest Pokemon Game Freak has ever given us. And I don't know when to <laughs> try Terra Bug. <laughs> uh, I'm just going to triple dive. And he's for sure not going to die, but he's for sure going to flinch. Because one of these Wug Trio, you can't see it. One of these guys is wearing a cool hat. Or, sorry, a crown that makes people flinch. I'm talking about big Wug energy. I know that he doesn't have anything that can Oko me. Which is why we go into the Wug Trio here. He just stays in. Oh, okay. In this is why we don't use Wug Trio. Big damage. <laughs> flinch? <laughs> Let's go, the flinch. <laughs> okay, this is fine. We'll just flinch him again. Hold, he's probably like, how the fuck did I just flinch there? <laughs> he's probably so confused. He's like, I fl d just triple dive flinch? We had three rolls with the flinch there, and that's, that's why you... Sorry, I doubted you, Wug Trio. I'm gonna need to still get another flinch here. <laughs> Please. Okay, one more easily kills. Flinch? No! No, it has wild charge! Fuck! <laughs> no! I didn't even think about the wild charge, bro. Okay, that's fine. Bro, Wug Trio did nothing against his team anyway. It did nothing, and he dies. The recoil, it's fine. Ah, uh, shit, I forgot about Wild Charge, man. That's annoying. Okay, so I can't really use Slacking until that Rock Fella is taken care of. <sighs> Do I think he's gonna... What is he gonna go into on the Empty Battlefield here? This actually sets the pace of the match. I think he's gonna go either Primate or that Garganical. If I go Tropius and he goes Braviary, I'm in a really bad spot. Fuck. I'm going Tropius. Oh no. It's not looking that good for me, boys. <laughs> Wug Trio. Okay, he does go Rabska. So, this weird ass dude with his. You know what this guy's thing reminds me of? His weird little brain? You remember that candy from um, J Jimmy Neutron? Like, everybody wanted the candy? It looks like that. Candy's delicious. Alright. Look delicious. <laughs> Hey, Naval Pain, thank you for the gift sub. I am going to substitute one time on him, because I am faster, because this thing about slow as tits. Now, let's see what this thing does. What what does this thing even do? No! <laughs> Other than Revival Blessing is what I was going to say. <laughs> However, this is fine. I'm behind the substitute. Rumble, thank you very much for the Prime sub. No, and it has the Leopard Berry. Bro, it can even use Revival Blessing again. This is some bullshit, bro. Okay, so... Now I Terra Water in case it has the bug move. Fuck. I can't believe he's done this. He can't be bringing Pokemon back to life. This is, someone banned this move immediate, immediately. Like, that's some bullshit. But what are you gonna do about some wet bananas, bro? What are you gonna do about it? Ain't nothing. I really wish I had Swords Dance now. I should've taught this thing. Okay, big boy damage. <laughs> yeah, Revival Blessing only has one PP, but he had a Lepidberry, so he brings both of his Pokemon back to life right now. Hello? <laughs> There's no way. So now, they both have half health, but they're both back. The Tauros is back, Delibird is back. I'm upset. All that work. <laughs> fucking rap skip, bro. Not the Revival Blessing, man. The fucking Lepidberry too? Give me a crit or something. Put, just die. There we go. Okay, that just kills it. Didn't need the crit. Just kill it. Okay, but this is fine. Rab's good down. And so he still now has five Pokemon because two of them have been revived. However, I'm behind the substitute and I ain't afraid. Tropius matches up actually decent against everything except for the fucking Braviary. So that's what sucks. I just have to basically aerial ace it and try to chip that thing. If I can kill... Let me just go to Amazon Prime. He's going back to the belly bird. Once you get more hazards up... Oh, that fool just straight up dies. <laughs> he revived my dude just to kill him again. He takes half from Stealth Rock because he's flying ice die. <laughs> you hate to see a Lepidberry get... get wasted. 
<laughs> he just straight fucking dies. Oh my god. Okay, so in comes Braviary. Now, I just Terra Blast here. Strongest stab move. Get some big boy damage. <laughs> that was fucking hilarious. Goes for the Crush Claw and misses. Tropius is the GOAT. I told y'all about Tropius. Y'all were sleeping on Tropius. Yo, that's actually... That puts me in a really good spot. Oh, my God. oh never mind. It doesn't. Because Tropius fucking can't do any damage. This guy can't... This guy can't Terra Blast his way out of a wet paper bag. And I feel bad for him. Although, luckily, he's Braviary. He's using Crush Claw for some reason. I don't know. But this is fine. So my sub fades. Do I have a switch into this? Kind of. I think basically just chipped this. And honestly, Tropius does pretty well. I can live in attack. Why is he using Crush Claw? Does he not have his... Is it a flying move or anything? I mean, actually, wait, I'm water type. <laughs> this thing can't touch me, bro. I'm Terror Blasting again. We're about to Tropius our way. Oh, he's got the Sky Attack. Does he have the Herb? There's no way. There's no way he gave himself the Herb with this... Okay, luckily, I'm not Grass type. Fuck! It still kills me! <laughs> not the trope, bro. Not the trope. Okay, that... I didn't see that one coming. I'm not gonna lie. I will say I did not see that one coming. So now I go into Lycanroc. And now, what is unfortunate is that... Uh, he's gonna tear that freaking salt guy. And even my Gallade's not gonna be able to touch it. This is not good. This is not good. This is not good. Um, well... I Accelerock here just in I and mean, he's gonna he's gonna sack this thing I assume because it can't switch into Stealth Rock very well. And I don't know damage calcs on an Accelerock that or the uh a Lycan Rock that has no attack investment against a Braviary that has no investment. I guess a crunch would have killed, but that's my safest bet there is taking care of the Braviary. So now the biggest problem is that salt there, dude. Plus that Tauros is back alive. Which is quite annoying, because that Tauros just comes in easily now too. And I and not in the greatest position here. He still has that Primate as well. Okay, he goes into Salt. Realistically, Lycanroc does nothing for me here. What's my win condition? Win condition is Gallade setting up. Gallade can honestly do it to him. I can Wisp it, get up a Sword Stand. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. I crunched to get some chip on this thing. This is gonna heal this one. This thing is way too defensive. Did nothing to him. Just salt gears me. Okay. I should be able to get some decent chip on this thing to the point where the close combat kills. You know what sucks about salt cure is even when you kill this guy, it's still here. Like you still get hurt by it. It's unfair. Crusty crab unfair. Okay, so we basically die this next turn. However, I can go for another crunch. Roll another chance for a defense drop. Give it to me. I'm surprised he hasn't Terra, which makes me concerned about when I go into the Gallade against it. He, ooh, now he just sets up the Stealth Rock. Okay. Alright, he's looking for them hazards. That's fine. Okay, okay. Leftovers is quite unfortunate. My rock's being cured over here. And I crunch again. Give me a defense drop, please, Lord Arceus. I don't ask you for much. Just a little defense drop. Is that a crit? No. Just did a decent amount. Rock slide kills. And okay, we got this thing below half. We're actually in pretty good, pretty good spot here. But is the primate? What's the primate gonna do? Because oh, I did get a defense drop on the last one. Oh, I literally was not looking. <laughs> How was I not looking? I'm stupid. Okay, well, it's fine. We go Gallade here. I was wondering why that one did so much more. I was asking Lord Arceus and I got I got some hacks anyway. All right, so here's the thing. Gallade can take an attack from this thing, but I'm gonna Wisp here. And that's because he's gonna Terra into something weird. He's gonna Terra, no, okay. He doesn't Terra. He hasn't terra yet, right? He's just salt cures though. That was actually a dumb idea. Slacking can 1v1 the primate. 
but the Tauros is the issue, because I basically need to kill like two things with this Gallade. Do I just close combat here? I don't think he can... I'm not, I'm not going to be able to outlive this thing. The Salt Cure is too annoying. I basically CC here. Hope that this goes down. I don't know. Let's go. Okay, perfect. Amazing. Now he's down to Tauros and Primate. Like his Gen 1 out here. The Tauros is a different color though. Aldan Tauros and a Primate. If I can... Yeah, I think I go down to Scarf Tauros easily. After that Salt Cure. I'm for it. He already had the Scarf... Tauros. Is this a Scarf Primate? Is this thing going to... Is this faster anyway? I think I just click Psycho Cut. Oh, I knocked the Scarf off of the Tauros, actually. That's correct. Um, oh yeah, Raging Bulls are straight up fighting. Well... Well, boys. I click Psycho Cut here. Primeape is gonna Terra. Okay, well we get to see what the Primeape turns into. <laughs> and it all comes down to my slacking, who can not attack twice in a row. This is not, this is not good for me. And of course it's Fairy, it's Fairy Ape. Which is interesting. And he just goes for the Rage Fist, but without any boosts, he just kills me. <laughs> I was like, maybe there's, maybe this is the most defensive Gallade of all time. Okay, well that sucks. But, there's no way he would, he, he can't be choice. There's no way he choices himself into that. Because he knows I have slacking as my last mod. But I'll tell you what, we're going out swinging, boys. Because I don't think this thing can kill me. <laughs> and so, I know it probably can't Oko me here. I don't know. I'm, I'm just going to give you impact. I'm kind of bulky. Oh, we just outspeed. The slacking is fast as hell. Let's go. <laughs> now it's us against the zombie Tauros. Because for whatever friggin' Tauros, he was revived from the dead. And now, unfortunately, I have to, you know, recharge and shit. <laughs> but we knocked that thing Scarf off, and it has the Raging Bull. But this thing's not invested. And so at least this is coming down to it. The freaking Revival Blessing got my ass, bro. It was funny against the Deli Bird, but... Do I live this Raging Bull? Let's go. But... What is... What is Slacking's speed stat? 117? Is Tauros... I think I win this game. Is Tauros fast? No! He has speed! <laughs> They're both base 100. Dude, there's no way. Oh my god, the revived Tauros got me, bro. <laughs> Was that a speed time? Hold up. I gotta ask him. Bro. What was the speed stat of your Tauros? <laughs> what? So what? What is the speed stat of your Tauros, bro? I... Hold oh, on, let me, let me check. We have to check. check right now because I'm pretty sure that was like really close. Dude, I'm telling you, when I'm like, I'm sitting here in my chat's like, you're fast, you're fast. I'm like, dude, he literally just outsped Primeape, who had 95 <laughs> base speed. 120. No, oh, you outsped me by three points. <laughs> dude. dude. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, listen, I lost because of three points in the speed stat. <laughs> you hate to listen, see man. But hey, I thank you very I... much for watching. As always, hey, leave a like and let me know if you like these kinds of videos. Uh, I think they're, it was really fun. And this one turned out way closer than I thought it was going to. So <laughs> well, check out Cypher's channel. His link is in the description, of course, as always. And uh, I'll catch you guys later. Peace out.